Star of RHOC Jennifer Pedranti, is she still on online fans? Tamara Judge spent the last two episodes attempting to figure out how to help her co-star and friend earn a little extra cash. She then made the decision that Jen needed to be put on OF. What transpired as a result, and did Jen follow through? For all the information, continue reading. RAOC does Jennifer Pedranti continue to use OnlyFans? On terms of money, Jennifer Pedranti has dealt with a lot on season 18 of RHOC. She began by revealing that she had been forced to leave their house along with her children. She said she was unaware that her estranged spouse had been failing to pay his share of the rent. She was forced to leave as a result, but fortunately for her, co-star Gina Kirschenheider works as a real estate agent, and she was able to find her a rental. Furthermore, Jenna attested to her ignorance of the fact that she would not fulfill her rental obligations. There was a lot of tension since Gina believed Jen had ruined her new profession. She was also enraged by Jen's constant glitzy appearances and brand new outfits. She was unable to pay her bills, nevertheless. In the end, the cast took two trips, one to La Quinta and the other to Tamara Judge's Big Bear residence. Jen accompanied Tamara, and it was there that Tamara made a choice. She was using online fans to promote Jen in an effort to get some revenue. Even more, they returned to the house and dipped Jen's feet in pie, which Tamara then licked off. Rian Boyajian, Jennifer Pedranti's boyfriend, was immediately opposed to it after she told him about it when she got back to the OC. What transpired with her online fans then? It turns out that the answer is no. It's unclear if Tamara created one at all. Simply declare that she would, or had it taken down. In any case, it is not mentioned on any of her social media accounts, and she is not visible on online fans either. It is plausible that she went under a pseudonym, but how would people be able to locate and assist her in that case? Fans don't care about it. Following the episode, fans took exception to Tamara Judge's insistence that Jennifer Pedranti sign up for online fans. Even though it was a joke, they thought it was cheap and tacky. It's incredibly patronizing, as in, oh, my friend is having financial difficulties as a result of her divorce. Let's ignore her and create content for online fans. It's even worse that Tamara never mentions that her power was cut off once a season and her fitness center closed. The scene where Jen was saying to Tamara that she was glad they were friends made me sad. I'm hoping Jen doesn't genuinely believe Tamara is a buddy. It makes me think of Tamara's attempt to make Gretchen feel naked wasted. Tamara is a horrible person. It appears Tamara could actually be the issue here. It was also mentioned that Tamara had the option to assist her in obtaining real estate or anything similar, but she opted for this. Do you find it surprising that the OnlyFans page no longer exists, or did you always assume it was a joke? Furthermore, do you think Jen shouldn't take Tamara's advice going forward? Watch Bravo's RHOC Thursdays and let us know in the comments below.